So if you walk to a Warhammer event and you see a helmet with a balloon attached to it, would you automatically know what that meant? Well, here at ETC in Novi Sad, Serbia, um, it is a signal for the best painted nominations. And there are one, two, three, four, five nominations this year. And one of them goes to Team Canada. So we're going to have a look at Team Canada's attempt. Hello. Hello. Are you happy with your painting nomination? Yes, exactly. But it's really all Andy's work, not mine. He said he painted three of the armies. Uh, yes, he did. Fantastic. The warriors, the demons and the dwarves were all Andy's work. Warriors, yeah. demons and dwarves. Yeah. Get the old Chimera in. He's... This is the fun bit. Oh dear lord. Madness. It's good. It's the Demon Prince. That's nice. Really, really good. Did he do these two? There's an Andy special as well. There's an Andy special. There you go. I do apologise for focusing in and out. This is an awesome dead pile. Nice shading. Grumpy old man. <laughs> Love it. So there we go, yeah. I do apologise because it needs to autofocus. Uh, next, we are just going over the way to the blue flag that you can see just there. I think this is for the Norway guys. So let's have a look at some of their specimens. What on earth is that? Five lights. One left. It's a beautiful hand in the shot, as you can see. Love it. Uh, we'll just go around. See if we can get a better look from this side. I think this is a really cool model. It gets there in the end, focusing. I like it. Ooh. So we'll have a look at a few more, because they've got some more armies just down here. Ding, 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 and the bell. So, yeah. So now we are moving down to the next one, which is just here, which I think is Italy. So this little video is just to give you a kind of insight into what the judges are thinking and the standard of the paint. Love the little head he's got.
have a look at the Phoenix. That's beautiful. I really like the shading on this. That's good. I bet that was one of the reasons why why it was nominated. So yeah, sorry for this moving as well. Going backwards and forwards. Actually, no, we're going to look at some more. Look at some more. Very colourful. Very, very colourful. around here to look at some big thing on a rock. Lots of attention to detail under the wing. It's good. Cool. So we are going to move on to the yellow. Have I done the red balloon? I haven't done the red, have I? We need to do the red balloon. Hungry, team hungry. Oh look, there's another phoenix. So pretty. So, so pretty. Right, but we'll have a look. Here's the team hungry person. A little bit dark, not the best. I will get some pictures of these as well, so you can see. Well, that's an awesome model, look at that. Lots of effort has gone into this. Beautiful. And a big steam tank thing. Or the bottom of a steam tank. That's okay, it's dwarf airplane. It looks like a bottom of a steam tank though here, doesn't it? The bottom bit. But it's a chaos dwarf airplane. Love it. Great. Oh wow. It's like they're bringing shiny things out. It's amazing. Look at that. Love it. Okay. So we are now going to the yellow balloon. painting standard, I think, is quite high for the ones we've seen, especially uh, the hungry team. They seem like they're hungry for victory. Got some vamps here. One little, two little ghouls. Fantastic. Uh, we'll just have a little look. 
down the other end. I will, of course, as I've already mentioned, get some pictures when they're all set out and displayed, but I thought I'd give you a, a heads up straight away. Best painted nominations. Lots of blue here. So this is Team Italy. That's cool, it's got feet on it. I like it. Fantastic. So, yes. I hope you like them. Uh, don't forget to check out our Facebook page uh, where there's going to be some pictures of it later on as well from them. So, bye bye.